so you've just clicked on the video with a bicep pose any reason for the thumbnail no but anyways it's day 27 of the no media series for you guys only tuning into my videos right now watching them for the first time this is where i disconnect from the abundance that the media offers in today's day this media abundance it tries to clear your brain from what's actually supposed to be there and fill your brain with their garbage it's trying to get you addicted to their nonsense so then they can control you because it's quite hard to actually get away from that social media once you're actually in it you have fear of missing out and you kind of really want to stay connected and you want to be social although it's making you less social and you kind of you get that loop so yeah let's talk about something else today and by the way if you're only watching this for the first time this is where i document how i feel every single day so fear of missing out right i've mentioned this briefly so you know how people say oh i have a fear of missing out that's why i don't quit social media well have a look at your screen time go in your settings right now on your phone have a look at your screen time how much do you spend on your phone and on social media apps how much time do you spend watching youtube videos now is it over like three hours is it over four hours <laughs> because i mean i had to have a fear of missing out life if i had that kind of screen time and i did I had more screen time i think I, at its peak i had like a six or seven hour screen time and yeah i was proper missing out on life i had a fear of missing out on life and not only that i still had a fear of missing out on social media it never goes away no matter how much you spend on social media the addiction gets stronger you just have more cravings to go on social media because you stay there more it becomes like more of a habit it's the same if you take like drink alcohol you'll become an alcoholic and you'll want more alcohol if you like take heroin right inject heroin it's like you want more and then you know the dose that you actually initially took is not enough for you anymore and it's like you need more and more it's like you're an addict for social media so and this fear of missing out will keep growing so it's not like it's not like you're doing anything by going on social media more. You're not like staying more connected. You're not doing anything. Even like watching YouTube videos. It's not like you're learning anything new. It's not like you're just pleasuring yourself. You're just the hedonistic lifestyle. That's all you're doing. It's just you're leading a hedonistic lifestyle. And I'm saying this to myself just as much as I'm saying this to you. Because yeah, this week has actually been the toughest week for me doing the series. And I've fallen back into some of my old habits I've watched a YouTube video or two and you know it's like you see that progress slipping away from your hands that you've made it's day 27 now and I can I can see how easy it is to lose all of that progress that I've just made and it's scary so you know from tomorrow onwards I'm making a promise to myself to really 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 stick to this series and just work harder do things that are better for me long term this delayed gratification instead of instant gratification read more i haven't been reading as much as i thought i would be reading all i'm doing with my spare time is kind of like just playing a lot of chess and just messing around not doing too much not doing anything serious so with this time that i have of abundance now like i do have a lot of time because i'm not really watching any youtube videos although like you know i maybe watch like 20 minutes of youtube during this week and this is bad for me because like the previous weeks i watched none so you know it's kind of like going downhill but still we can fix this but yeah it's like i need to actually start doing stuff I need to actually start reading more I need to get myself a good version of the bible and start reading the bible because it's one of my one of my goals read the bible no matter how long it takes no matter how difficult it is have a notebook decipher it have my own interpretation and it's exciting i'm excited for our journey so yeah that's kind of the update for today so if you have a fear of missing out and you have a screen time of like five hours then you shouldn't be f having a fear of missing out from social media you should have a fear of missing out on life and what you're not doing in real life because you could be doing much more this is the message if you like the message spread it like the video subscribe comment comment what you think i should improve on these videos be uh be a critic you know 
sometimes your own criticism isn't enough. You need other people's criticism. And being open to criticism is very good. That's how you actually progress. So thanks for watching. And as always, peace.